Hello everybody, my name is Jeremy and this is week two um, video review. This week we learn about file formats, um, CSV, WDDX, XML, JSON, um, getting it ready for the remote, I guess, remote servers. What went better than expected this week? I would say writing the formats. Um, I was pretty familiar with HTML and JavaScript objects, so it wasn't really too tough to choose a few off the bat. Um, was kind of familiar with the actual writing. What didn't go so well, I would have to say trying to load that into my web app. Um, for some reason, I had difficulties loading JSON, XML, WDDX. Um, even my local storage didn't really want to load. Um, I did spend a lot of time this week fixing my crude functions. Um, I wish I had more time. The shift I currently have at work is terrible. That's why I'm writing this uh, video, doing this video review a day before, um, as I'm going to be working all day tomorrow till the deadline. I'm hoping between my breaks and my lunch that I'm able to fix this code and get my application run up to speed like I've been trying to do all week long. Um, skills that I've ha I used from previous courses I would have to say would be the JSON and the objects, um, the function calls, loading the JSON I would have said it would have been one of, them, one of them but I couldn't get it to work so that one Still working on it. Me and JavaScript are just not and talking terms right now, I guess you could say. It's not my favorite. Um, for the application that we use that uses this kind of data, um, one that anyone that uses Gmail would know about, or Android devices, which is the calendar application. The calendar application is really useful it gives you um, alarms it lets you know what's going on I put a lot of my information on there um, just so if I'm real busy I know exactly what to do when to do it um, one for example is my baby girl's doctor appointment it kinda just stores any information that you put in it um, you can set the time and everything else like that and the format that it actually uses is CSV which is pretty neat because um, that would be kind of universal for any other application to tie into it any application to grab its data um, upload data to it so it makes it pretty simple for developers uh, who want to tie into the calendar application from Google um, that is one thing also to keep in mind when building an application is not to make it too closed off and not compatible with other applications and other developers as that will kind of limit your functions on the application well it's extremely late and this will end my video for week two i uh, hope to see you guys all next week thank you